Hey guys, this is Hell Hades. This is a Raid Shadow Legends video. Guys, I'm getting drowned in questions, so I need to answer them. Best way I can do it is in a video. So apologies. I'm doing a similar video to what I did last week, but this one's really important because we have made two big changes to the optimizer and damn, people don't understand what we've done. We've actually done it because it's fixing the most critical issue that we've seen since the optimizer has been running for like over the last 12 months. It's a question we get asked again and again and again. And what we're trying to do is help newer players that are using the optimizer to optimize their gear. We've also done a couple of extra additions uh, based on what you'd asked for. So again, we're just going to run through a quick tutorial of how to get it and uh, get people involved if they want to be involved. Basically, you need to get yourself over to hellhades.com. When you are there, you just need to be a member. It could be a completely free member. You don't have to pay for this. Uh, if you do pay, you get a couple of upgrades. And, and if you do pay, you only need to be at an uncommon level to get all of the upgrades. We're not like, you know, do this to get a, a better, improved version. It's literally just, if you want it, you've got it. But yeah, go to Optimizer here. You download the Optimizer. You log in. We never ask for your Raid Shadow Legends login details. It's always just your login details to this website. Uh, you log yourself in. You get this little fancy gizmo, and then you update or upload to website, and away you go. It is a PC-based or a Mac-based thing. So unfortunately, we can't help with mobile. That's not changed. Okay, what has changed? This is something we, that was asked for based on our last update. We've cranked it in straight away. So we've now got the suggest team function. Let's go into, uh, I don't know, dragon. Suggest team function has always been there. But now you can say, please exclude champion. So we last week we did please include. Now we're saying exclude as well. So it might be that you're using a law for finite and you don't want to touch that build. You don't want her to be part of the team suggestions for other places. You can say, don't show me any teams with a law. Yeah. And you might also be like, and don't show me any teams with my arbiter because I use her uh, exclusively for arena, for example. But I definitely want to see Septimus. Okay. And then you can apply that filter and it will show you teams with that kind of scenario. Might be similar like here. C is popping up all the time. Uh, whoa, I don't want to change my Seer build because I'm already using her in tons of stuff. So please don't show me Seer. And then it will, it will then pop Seer out of the mix and it will show you other variations based on a no Seer team, which actually is very cool if you think about... Um, Seeing some teams here with fast times, 56 seconds here, one minute and five, with no Sears in the mix. It's actually pretty fun. Um, and then once you've got the team that you want, it's still press view variations. It will show you the success rate. It will show you how many runs that's done so far that the optimizer has recorded. And it will show you the speeds of the champions. If you're then an uncommon or above member, you can actually go into the full detail page and get a breakdown of everything, masteries, gear sets um, and the AI setup. So the other thing we've added, Saf's literally added this over the weekend. Basically, we've got this bit now here that says show teams with all champions from a specific faction. So in Dragon 25, you can literally go, bam, Knight Revs, because that's going to be the one that's coming up. And then you can hit apply filter. Now, this will only show you champions that you own. Yeah, so I actually don't own Walking Tomb Dreng, and I know that he can be really quick for night uh, for dragon so mine's not going to show it but yours might uh, it will only show you champions that you own it will also only show you uh, versions of teams that have been captured by the optimizer already so you know if you was going into i don't know the the finite one for demon spawn there's not going to be that many because so far not many people have played around with it uh, i would say if you are playing around with this stuff please keep this little optimizer box open because then there's going to be more information captured for other people to find the team that they want. Yeah, and then you'll see a bunch of probably a law teams here or whatever. Um, but as I said in my video the other day, I feel like the Demon Spawn and the, and the Dark Elves were picked the wrong way around. Because you're going to struggle to get quick teams uh, with Demon Spawn on Finite. And I think you're going to struggle the other way around as well. Anyway, anyway, I digress. Let's talk about the other big change. This one is throwing people off, uh, but we actually did it to help you. 
So if we go into any champion now and hit optimize, let's just reset so we've got a fresh look. If I go into battle and I choose a balanced score, and a balance basically means uh, I want you to push a certain stat or I don't really want a damage build. The, the only reason I would choose balance really is if I don't, if I want to go high on one or two stats. Yeah. If I want someone to hit hard, I choose damage. If I want someone to survive well, I choose survivability. But if I want someone to have a high couple of stats, I would choose balanced. Yeah. And then when we go into stats, as soon as I select a minimum or a maximum, so if I select minimum speed 200, you'll see this little circle has gone small. I can't change it. I can't push a stat anymore. What this is saying is we're already finding you that. We're now already finding this stat. So we don't need for the optimizer to see it as a priority. It's already a priority. Yeah, what people were doing is they were saying, I want 200 speed. And then they were whacking this priority bar up to max. That tells the optimizer, I want 200 and as much more as you can give me. And as much more as you can give me. Yeah, that's what the optimizer sees that as. So if you just want to go high on speed, just use the slider, right? But if you want a specific speed, like for a clan boss speed tune, you put your minimum in, it will find that anyway. And then you say, any additional stats you can find me, push it here. That's what the sliders do. Okay, so it's not, a, it's not a bug. It's not something we need to fix. It's something we've done on purpose because people were using it incorrectly. Yeah, so a lot of people, if you, if you really want to use the balance uh, build properly, you would just have like one main stat you absolutely want to hit. And then you would just say, okay, I also need speed and I need a lot of accuracy. And, and if you want to kind of get even more technical with it, almost like consider here, plus four, plus eight, plus 12. Consider that as plus four, I'm looking to find on average one roll of that stat on my gear. Plus four, uh, plus eight, I'm looking to find on average two rolls of that stat on my gear. Plus 12, you've guessed it, three rolls. And plus 16, basically, I want to be finding quad rolls. That's pretty much the way you would roll it, So, or the way you would do it. So I would go like this, optimize, and it works. Yeah, whether it finds me something or not, oh, it does. High accuracy, high speed. And if you're like, yeah, but I kind of wanted it to be a bit more speed focused and accuracy, you know what? You can just be like, pull the accuracy one down below the speed, go again, and it will find faster builds, but with a bit less accuracy. And you can kind of play around with the dynamic of these. Yeah, you can literally go, go through. This is what I do, a bit back and forth if I'm doing a balanced build until I find the dynamic that, that makes most sense for me. Yeah, so it'd be like, well, I'm way over on accuracy, but I want to keep the high speed. And you can kind of punch it to then go more speed, less accuracy. Yeah. So we've done it on purpose. It's not something we need to fix. Please share the word. Yeah. Share the word to your clans because we're being inundated with questions, but we've actually done it to help you, not to hinder you. Uh, there you go, guys. That's a quick update from me. I've been Hell Hades. Enjoy your optimizing. I'll see you later.